in past I-Team reports, the Cook County Assessor admitted that some South Suburban homeowners were overassessed. Now we're finding there were more than 4,000 of these errors. We obtained a letter showing that the Assessor's Office is working to correct them. We're working uh, to correct some of the errors. Uh, there's a thousand of them that fell in our lap. Cook County Board of Review Commissioner George Cardenas is referring to this letter from Cook County Assessor Fritz Kagey to commissioners, stating his office is correcting a significant number of property values in the south and west suburbs for the tax year 2023. It says the land value for those properties was calculated incorrectly, resulting in a higher assessed value of many properties. Cardenas says his office has been working for months digging into the issue. We do everything we can to, to protect uh, homeowners, especially my district. I, I'm, I'm very much hands-on, so I'm working with the township assessors uh, in Berwyn, in Lyons, in Ward Township. Last November, we uncovered errors in the Tinley Park area. The assessor admitted to some mistakes. Then in the spring, a similar story with residents in Lyons Township. Jamie Flaws told us her property tax assessment hike could double her taxes. We probably won't be able to sell these homes because they're not even close to being worth what the assessment says. Assessor Kagey's office admitted to the I-team that it made an error on Flaw's assessment, then submitted a request for a correction to the Cook County Board of Review. Now there's that letter talking about more errors, which the assessor says total over 4,000. The I-team obtained a list of 1,000 of those properties. There's no doubt in my mind that the I-team uh, ABC helped. And, and because you picked up the, the, the story, you gave it live. Assessor Kagey's office released a statement to the I-team about the letter saying affected property owners won't have to do anything and that the corrections will be completed in time so these homeowners will not pay more in property taxes than they should. The assessor's office added that the correction process has not been finalized yet. Again, the hope is to have the corrections made before the July property tax bills come out. Ruby Cheryl, that way consumers will not have to do anything at all. Obviously, if you ever have an assessment issue, if you mm -hmm. think your assessment was too high, make sure you are appealing or mm -hmm. call us the I-team. We can yeah. help. Yeah, look at the detail work, the <laughs> diligence. Gotta say, I great know. story. Yeah. Great job, great work We'll too. keep following. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.